What's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Vanilla Minecraft Season 2. Last time we explored, found ourselves a heart of the sea, and then I told you guys what I wanted to do over on this island. Now, to do this I need two cows, well, a minimum of two cows to start with, and I have two boats down here that I will be using to guide them over to our island and I do have myself a very nice uh, way to get them to breed the way I want and um, well then that guy got in quite easily but this guy is not so we are gonna do our darndest dang it Okay, can we pick them up? That is the question, and I don't think we're going to be able to pick them up. Oh no, okay, so we're just going to get this guy over here. And um, I'm going to show you guys what I'm going, what I want to do for these cows. So I'm actually not going to take them off just yet. Okay, can, there we go. I guess I had to hold it. I don't know. So we're gonna come through here. And my mouse was dying, so I had to plug it in. I have a wireless mouse, but now it's uh, on a cord, so it's gonna be a little wonky for me for a little bit because of how the cord is actually positioned. But uh, yeah, right before I wanted to record, the my mouse decided it was gonna go ahead and die on me. So I did finish the uh, AFK fishing fishing farm on this uh, serve on the world so I can show you guys that here momentarily and we did get the yes we got the cow good um, I have a new position for my mic I do not have the mild pop filter on it anymore so it should sound clearer and hopefully better but um, yeah we got those two and this thing has actually been producing quite a bit of eggs. I have not been able to get AFK for too long due to the fact um, I've been doing so many things and Minecraft on my computer is actually actually slows down a lot of stuff so I have to close it out but yeah this is the AFK fishing farm that I made down here is a complete work, of pro uh, work in progress but for now this is the simple uh, storage system that I have and we only got maybe not not even halfway through this chest but we did get a couple of good things so name tags we got some books and one of them had mending on it I think yeah one of them had mending on it and I actually put it on this uh, fishing rod which also has um, luck of the sea 2 and unbreaking so it is a very good uh, fishing rod I'm actually hoping to get a couple more enchantments on it and then it should be the perfect fishing rod so I'll give you I'll give you guys updates on that as the as things go on and as you could tell I do have access to the Sun so that way we get better spawns but yes um, I am going to go over to the my uh, redstone world and I'm going to show you guys what I want to do with these cows so I will be right back we are back and this is what I want to do with my cow farm so I'm going to have a fence post in the center and then have uh, a good collection of adult cows in here and one of these is actually going to be a dispenser so it dispenses water and it can um, let them jump and I can feed them um, what is it wheat there we go and then the babies uh, the baby cows or the calves are gonna spit out into this area and that is actually as far as I've gotten build wise but I do have a idea that I want to do where once uh, once I killed uh, once I do my meat and leather collection collecting I put 
all the items that I got into an uh, into a chest and then it goes through a filter if it's leather it will go into a, an, ar an array of chests kind of like this so it'd be like a three tall chest system and then the meat would go into a system where it would cook it and then it would then go into another set so I would have my uh, a good a good source of meat and leather and then over here is actually the chicken farm that I want to create on the island as well and just like for over here it's not going to be where the chest is up here it's actually going to go underneath and go into an array and this is where the cave that I want to build is going to come into play so let us pop back over to the survival world and we'll move on from there all right we are back on and oh I'm not actually in creative anymore I almost tried to do the creative jump but <laughs> I I quickly realized I was not on there anymore so yeah I want to create a cave I, I figured out that this area is not actually going to be good enough for the cave but this area right here because it has such a wide like uh, opening right here I'm actually going to carve out a little space like right here so I'm going to keep some of the structure of the island but I'm going to create a cavern where we're going to have our chests because that's going to be our storage uh, station where we have all our all our food and products in there while up here is where all the products are actually made or collected and then it gets sorted down under so that way it's easy to come in and grab what what is needed to be delivered to the other islands and then go on their merry way so we are actually going to do that and I'm actually going to carve out the area or a small area in a time lapse so I will see you guys after the time lapse and I just heard a zombie there might be a cave here somewhere so well, I guess we'll find out and let the time lapse begin
All right, so I did a little bit of digging and I actually did a small bit of decoration. I, I don't know which one I like more. So I just put both down to see what I want to look at more often. And over here, I think I may replace some of these guys with uh, gravel, even though I'm going to need a lot of gravel for our island over there. But yeah, so I got this built this is actually going to be the storage area and if i have to i will expand it a little bit and then this will be our corridors so that way we can get through all the different areas that are going to be up here which would be like our chicken farm our uh, cow farm and sooner or later we're going to have a pig farm and a sheep farm although i do not think i want the sheep farm here i think i may want it like on a distant island over there like that's an island and then over that way there is actually a um okay where, there's a drown nearby um there is a uh ocean temple so we are definitely going to go do that at some point and we are going to be able to make ourselves the um a farm for that so that way we can get a uh, a nice there we go a nice uh gosh i am like i can't think i don't know why i can't think a uh a farm for the sea lanterns there we go because we need sea lanterns to be able to do what i want to do for the island and so we're going to need those and i'm going to need a lot of fencing because the cows, I actually do not know where I want to put the cows. And I'm actually going to raise this area up, these two areas up a little bit. So that way I have room because this is actually going to be where the cows are going to go. So we're going to raise this up just a bit. So we're going to do a little bit of terraforming, terraforming with Gamer K, you know, just a little bit of that. And we should be able to get a decent size cow farm going. It's I don't want it to be too big because um, I want this island to be very functional and not look bad in any way, shape or form. Although some of these farms are definitely going to look kind of ugly but they are definitely going to be functional and that that's part of what I want so if I have to put functionality between um, good looking I will do that but I don't want to do it for all farms because I kind of do want this island to look decent so there we go okay I think we got a good enough space here so this is where I'm going to put the cows and no, I want to put them over just a little bit further this way. So about here, and then we can mark off the area that they are going to live in. So I am going to follow the contour of the island just a bit. So just like that. and then our newly put in area and then for us I am gonna do those so that way we can go in and out whenever we need so this is a little bit different so I'm gonna put this here and I do have half slabs which I can definitely change out at a later date Ooh, no I want it to be one more up that's what I want because that's what this is going to need because the half slabs are going to put them up a little bit so they're, uh, the adults will not come out where the babies will just fly on out because they are one block and the fence post goes a little bit over um, gives that little space I think the babies are actually less than a block so they are definitely going to fly out which is really nice for what I want to do here and I'm just gonna do some torching on here 
so that way it looks better I actually did go and explore a lot of area outside of here because I was looking for pumpkins so that way I can make this island look a little bit more decent but I could not find any pumpkins anywhere and it actually annoyed me because I'd looked for over an hour and couldn't find anything so we're gonna go ahead and break this and then these guys if they will follow me I'm just gonna get them in the pen for now because I have to get them up in there but I have to do a little bit more digging in there so oh come on there we go BAM they are in alright so I need to build myself a small platform up there and we're actually gonna make it two three wide yeah let's make it three wide for the animals themselves the cows because um, I need to get them down into this hole right here ooh ooh was it was it the right way the first time oh snap no it couldn't have been you know what I'm just gonna jump off camera and go look at that and so that way I have the appropriate positions for everything because I, I made the um, the cow farm like just in like no time so that way I could have a nice nicely done cow farm and I could okay I don't want them going here so we're just gonna do that so I will be right back I'm gonna go check the cow farm in for just one second so give me a moment all right I got it checked and the world is regenerating and I do have these just a little too low so with how this works I can good thing I'm in a couple of spares um, I can actually put this up one more because cows are pretty tall apparently so we we would have a block here and then we can go a half slab we can have an extra half slab of space and that should be it so actually I can do it from this side if I tried because this is where they're oh, come on you know what? I'm just gonna have it on both sides so um, nope Come on, guys. I got some nice wheat for you. Anybody? Come on, you must want some wheat, right? Do you you want the wheat? You want the wheat. Oh, both of y'all want the wheat now. Okay, so I want you guys up there. Good. And no, no. C c come on. Dang, Minecraft animals. They are so so hard to actually maneuver around no come on really get your butts back up here you guys really come on you guys are not stuck just hop on up there you go okay so this cow is in a good position so trying to get you down into this hole it's going to be a lot harder than I thought because it is very position wise and apparently I do not have the position correct so let me do this okay perfect all right and this cow can come over here come here come on I got the wheat for you right here yeah buddy now I just need you to come on up and come just a little bit more there you go buddy oh I fell do not move and oh yeah perfect so I'm I actually kind of screwed up a little bit 
but this is fine because I can block it off with oh can I though no I can't oh yeah okay it's fine we are good to go so what I was what I'm actually worried about is that I have that space actually open right now and I do not want it open because that's gonna happen so okay so I can do this dang it ran out of half slabs so I want that space to be closed for a little bit so that way I have that room to breed more and be able to oh why am I hearing a spider now? I have got to go exploring just on the inner surface of this area because that's actually annoying that I am hearing mobs. All right, so this is now good. And actually, let's come up here and destroy these two. And we can actually feed these, these guys, uh, maybe. Can I not feed both of them? Oh gosh. Can I need not feed both of you guys? There we go. So they should be making the baby. There we go. There's our baby. And I am definitely going to have to put a uh, dispenser for water. So that way they can start jumping up and I can do it a lot easier to the point where um, there is enough. So we are good here. And I think that is all I want to do this episode. This is actually, um, I mean, it's not too long. I mean, I don't know exactly how long the time lapse actually went for. So I don't want to make it too short of an episode. But in order to do the chicken farm, I'm going to need... Uh, quartz to make a comparator and I do not have a comparator quite yet oh my goodness you are like right there okay that's why I hear you but yeah I'm actually gonna end it off next episode we are gonna go to the nether so that way we can get some quartz and I can actually have the nether accessed to me for whenever we need to uh, go out and try and find a village because I am going to need a crap ton of iron and and the best way to do that without actually having a uh, without having to do branch mining is to have an iron farm so we are going to make an iron farm very soon possibly in the next three episodes I can't believe we're only on like episode three and I already am thinking about making an iron farm so Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed it, please leave a like. It lets me know that you guys uh, like the Minecraft series and you guys want me to do more. All right, let me get some food. And yeah, I will talk to you guys in the next episode. Have a wonderful day. Bye.